Hi, welcome to Fleming Fitness. I'm Marisa. You're joining us again for our part two of our Fit for Pregnancy series. Again, I'm going to show you a circuit of two exercises and two st stretches mixed together that anybody can do because they're great for posture, but they're specifically good for pregnant women. So let's get started. The first exercise I'm going to do is using a band. You can use any kind of band, but again, you want to keep the resistance fairly light. We're going to start with an external rotation, which is specifically good for posture, posterior delts. You're going to grab your band like this. You're going to make sure that your arm is at a nice 90 degree angle and you're going to externally rotate. Bring it out and hold. That's the key. Exhaling on the way out. So a lot of people move their elbows. You want to make sure you don't do that when you do this exercise. So one quick little tip I'm going to show you here is you can grab a rag, place it right in between your arm to make sure that it doesn't fall out. And then we know that your elbow isn't moving away from your body when you do this exercise. Again, exhaling on the way out. Bring it out and hold just like this. Really good for posture, okay? That's your external rotation. We're gonna go right into your next stretch of your circuit. This is the cat stretch. So you're gonna come down on the mat, on all fours, like this. And you're gonna draw your pelvis forward, stretching that lower back. It's a cat stretch. You might have seen some cats do this. But really what it does is it takes the pressure off your lower back. So we don't wanna be arching the back like this because you're already in that state. We wanna specifically focus on this stretch, releasing some of that pressure from your lower back. And you hold this anywhere from 30 seconds to a minute and just hold, bring in the abdominals, stretch out that lower back. Okay, so we're gonna go right into your next exercise, which actually is your inner thigh stretch. Again, also stretching the hip flexors, but your inner thighs as well. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna come, sit down like this, bring your knees out to the sides, your feet together, and you should ideally be able to, ideally, Bring your knees to the floor. So for a lot of people, this is a little difficult, but with time and practice, it can be totally done. You can put some light pressure on your outer legs here and make sure you get that nice stretch. You wanna be able to hold this for 30 seconds to a minute. No pain, but it should feel nice and comfortable. And again, releasing some of that pressure and, and just stretching there and hold that there. And last but not least, we're gonna go into our last exercise, which actually is again using those bands we used earlier. So any type of band, but you want to keep the resistance nice and light. We do an exercise called a row. So you're going to send your arms. You want to make sure your shoulders are back and down. We don't want to do any of this forward motion like this. We shouldn't see the shoulders doing any of this. Nice straight back, shoulders down and back, arms straight. And we're just going to extend those arms and bring them back like this. Squeeze those shoulder blades together. We like to tell our clients sometimes, pretend there's an orange right between your shoulder blade. And you're squeezing it, exhaling on the way back. Extending and holding. So 15 to 20 of these, again, great for posture. Doing these nice and slow, you shouldn't feel any pain. If you ever feel any pain, of course, you're going to want to stop. Back like this. So using those bands, make sure whatever you're using is nice and secure. So that's our second part of our Fit for Pregnancy series. I hope you enjoyed it, and see you soon.